Well, I really appreciate that my parents kind of put all of us, not just me, Nick and Daniel too, but um, they let us kind of try all the sports we wanted early on. Um, so I tried everything, soccer, lacrosse, basketball, swimming, diving. With all our kids, we, you weren't really sure exactly, you know, were they going to be arts, were they going to be athletic. Academic was a given, that was going to be a core part of it. And so we let them try a lot of different things. Got to try gymnastics at Kids First. My parents bought me this lime green leotard with sparkles on it and I loved it. Um, but I was just horrible and I just couldn't get my legs over my head. Her head came up and her legs were still coming around. And so I, I was at the point we said, okay, I think we need to tell her, maybe court sport. A court <laughs> sports are a better place to be. <laughs> yeah, she, um, she, yeah, she did fine in the gymnastics, but you could see she was much more at ease on the court as the years went on with volleyball and um, from then on I think she pretty well started to wrap up. We get recruited really young in volleyball so I was 15 when um, Coach Dunbar offered me. One I was looking for a place where you couldn't really go wrong if that makes sense so um, just a big enough and good enough school where maybe I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do with school. Um, but knowing that it had a really good business school, obviously then eventually maybe I could decide my, decide my major in. And she was someone that really came in with a direct path to where she wanted to go. And she stuck to that path and she excelled at such a high level. The rigors of what she really had to go through in the Kelly School of Business, which is one of the best in the country, and, and excel at it at the level she did um, is very impressive to me. Yeah, I mean, I think for myself and both of us, it's just fun to see her to be able to continue to do something she loves. It's really bittersweet, obviously. Um, there are some things I won't miss. I won't miss the Versa Climber. There are just so many more things that I'm going to miss so much, and I'm so thankful that I've gotten to do here and experience here. You can just tell how passionately she cares about things and um, how much of an influence she has on people's lives, and she's someone that people really are attracted to to hang out with and be around because of her positivity and I think that's something that she's going to carry with her the rest of her life and into her adulting as she calls it. So looking back it makes me smile but it also makes me tear up a bit um, because I mean this is home for me now <laughs> so um, obviously leaving something like that is really emotional. Um, in terms of just like the university, like I love it here so much. It's really nice to see when they finally get it and um, understand the importance of their role in, in something bigger than themselves. And I think she really truly got that this year.